Ah, uh, you're back to another Vinny Visits. Today, Pikmin 4, specifically the demo. Uh, Pikmin 4 is a game that I am very excited for, and it drops very soon, uh, in particular next month, as of the, the filming of this. Um, July 21st, uh, they released a demo. <laughs> I'm very excited. So... So, story. Rescue shipwreck castaways on an uncharted planet with the help of Pikmin in this epic adventure. Dan uh, Dandori battle is uh, multiplayer. And eShop is go buy the full game. You whore. Alright, let's see. Co-op mode, settings, controls, controls. Player 1 controls. Look ahead with ZL. Manual target lock with ZR. Select pit. Yeah, select Pikmin or Ochi with the bumpers. Options menu is minus, the tablet is plus. X is jump? Okay. Uh, hold down X to rush, ride or dismount with Y, and then hold Y to open actions. Apparently there is jump. Settings. I want motion control is cool. story it is. To complete this demo, you can receive special rewards in the smart device app Pikmin Bloom. Scan the QR code below for further details. The demo version is complete once you collect 1500 units of Sparklium and finish exploring for the day. You can import your save data from the demo into the full version of the game. How many players are there? Co-op mode, player 2, sports player 1 with simple targeting controls using the pebble pitcher. Uh, there is one player, but um... That sounds a lot like the co-star mode of, uh, Mario Galaxy 1. I'm not gonna go get Jake. Jake is asleep, I'm not gonna wake him up for this. So we loading. This loading taking a while. How many times is he gonna crash on this planet? You'd think he would learn by now. Of course. I think this is recounting Pikmin 1, yeah. Hello. Nilama to pick me, so Lugo Rinima. That's not to pick me too. Lava Saro to bar. Weba, Pelaba, Pukna. This is not Pikmin one. Because that thing was not in Pikmin one. I don't know. I mean, it could be. I don't know. We'll find out, I'm sure, but... The last area we have left to explore. Okay. Oh, this is like a m modern house. What the hell? Ooh. 
something about this area is different from the others we've explored so far. It looks like Pikmin 3 Onion. Wait, where are you running off to? Yeah, it looks like Pikmin 3 Onion, but with, um... But with Olimar. That can't be a good sign. Pikmin don't usually scurry off like that. I suppose I'll have to call them back while I search for the missing ship parts. Find the ship parts. Uh, look around. Move. Look ahead. Okay. I shaded them more in three. Interesting. I saw some of the Pikmin head this way. They could be hiding behind those things. Let's break them and see. When we jump, I'll start charging up my pup strength. Just need to press X and hold down. And then take aim. When she's at full strength, I'll let go and let her rush. Okay. Hey. How you doing? Pikmin. Uh-huh, I knew it. Now I'll use B to call them back to me with my whistle. That explains a lot. Okay. I just wish I knew why the Pikmin ran away and hid in the first place. Hmm, I better make note of this in my voyage log. Sure, recording log. And we won't know when this kind of information will prove useful. Now, how to freeze it. You got to play Pikmin early 3. Pikmin 3 early in front of a Nintendo rep. Nice. Uh, when I arrived at this area, the Pikmin started acting quite strange. They flew out of the Union and immediately hid. I can't find my spaceship parts without them. I suppose I'll just keep looking for them and call them back using my whistle. Number 76. Strange Pikmin behavior. I need to find my missing ship ports, but it will be much easier if I have more Pikmin to help me. So, in the... At least I have a few more Pikmin now. So, in the, um... In the switch ports of one, and probably two, the gyro aim only works when you're throwing or whistling. That is the same as what's going on here. Which is very odd. One good rush to break those. I knew I'd find you here. You should search the area below. Don't look before you leap. Looks like Pikmin 3 whistle. At least. Feel like Ghost of Wind. Okay. So if at some point I come back here. Graphics do look really good. We should tap X to jump and climb up. I hope I didn't miss any. Get on, loser! Do I want to know what's up there? That doesn't look good. A creature? Have they shown off rock or purple? Okay, the rep didn't know the red Pikmin were immune to fire and asked how you- and you were- and he was shocked that you knew that. You just got hit with a, a wave of nostalgia? How come? Because of this, or something else? Also, yes, Jordan, fucking graphics look amazing. I don't see any ship parts. Could that thing have swallowed one whole? Those spiky things are going to make this tough. I have to find an opening. Maybe I should use X to build up energy so we can rush the creature when the time is right. 
the meantime, let's circle it and wait for a chance to strike. You added me. In the meantime, uh, okay. I already read that. I wish I had more picking with me. Ow! Ugh, these spikes keep getting in the way. I miss! Yes, this is going to work. Come back, losers. It, ah, crap. I need to call the Pikmin with B now. And he's dead. You added me. Oh god, old annotations. It's the interstellar radio. We located it at last. With this back in my position, I can finally call for help. Loading, 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 loading. Great five star <laughs> ratings. They had recovered the interstellar radio. So we immediately sent out an SOS signal. And attached to the latest version of my voyage log. I doubt we're gonna see Louis. Days and weeks passed, but one month later. My signal reached the rescue core. I took off toward this remote planet with noble plans to bring me home safe. Please tell me they don't crash. I think the trailer said they could. Unfortunately, fate had other plans. Of course they crashed. It's PNF 404. The rescue officers sent to rescue me crash landed during their arrival. Double shipwrecks are rare, and extremely unlucky. At this point, you might think all hope was lost. But there was one last rescue officer left at Rescue Corps HQ. A rookie. You. That's right, you are my last hope. Help me, Obi-Wan. Emergency mission! Rescue the Rescue Corps. Following emergency protocol, op all officers were directed to evacuate the spaceship immediately. Finding the dispersed Rescue Corps is now your top priority. Create your ID badge and deploy immediately. Is there juice mechanic? I don't know! This is my first time playing through the demo! <laughs> Alright, okay. Create your ID badge. Um... That'll do. Body type. Go with that one. Because, well, that's more Louie. You haven't seen any trailers. That makes sense then. Uh, I have not seen anything resembling the juice mechanic. Uh, but I don't know exactly how it works. There's a very limited amount of faces. Louie went out and got spiky treads. I guess let's look through all of them. I love it. <laughs> it's so stupid, but I love it. I am known for being green. 
But my favorite color is blue. Enter your name. Normally I would name it Vinny, but... This is gonna be the first, uh... <laughs> the first rescue mission of Steve! The Rescue Corps guy! Rescue Corps Officer Steve! Home Planet Karoo. The Rescue Corps' newest officer, they recently accepted a dangerous mission to rescue their missing colleagues. <laughs> if I can't ban Jordan in his stream, he can't ban me in mine. Not only my fate, but the fate of the Rescue Corps lies in your hands, is probably what he's gonna say. Rests in the hand of one inexperienced adventurer. Wee woo wee woo. <laughs> Jordan, remind me. Wee -oo, wee -oo, wee -oo, wee -oo. Have you ever played Pikmin three, uh, Jordan? Search for the missing missing rescue officers. You have not. Okay. Let me tell you, that Pikmin 3 is just as beautiful. Uh, where is it? 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 Oh, it's not here. Oh, I'm so sad. I had, uh, screenshots of Pikmin 3 Deluxe. Only a bit of 1 and 2. Ah. That makes... It dog. Hello, dog. I never played it on Wii U, but I played 3 Deluxe. Rescue Corps, Rescue Pup, Ochi, home planet, Gia. This young, loyal rescue pup is one of an elite breed of space dogs that's long served the Shepherd family. This is his first mission. Found the rescue pup! One down, one, two, three, four, five, six to go. You encountered the Rescue Corps' rescue pup, Ochi. Uh, the remaining six rescue officers are still out there somewhere. There was a pop-up that I did not get to read because I walked too quick. Seven because all aren't true. You found someone in need of rescuing. How do I... Get in rescue operations at once. Send. This is one strong pup, oh my lord. Of course it's seven. Anything else? All the dirt has been removed. I just want to see, is there anything else around here? No, it doesn't look it. Alright, rescue the guy. That's like 30, probably... Uh, is that you, Ochi? Thank the star that I wasn't sure that my SOS signal had reached HQ. So you and Ochi found and rescued me together? It's actually quite surprising. I've never known Ochi to listen to anyone other than our captain. Oh, I should probably introduce myself. I'm Colin, a uh, communications opera operator for the rescue corps. Rescue Corps Officer Colin, Home Planet Gia. As the Rescue Corps comms operator, he handles communication for his fellow officers. Plus, he's handy with a wrench. Down comms operator Colin. Two down, one, two, three, four, five, six to go. Met up with Colin, the Rescue Corps comms operator. That's one down. Now, where could the other rescue officers be? My path got cut off by a small landslide, and when my hunger became unbearable, I decided to nap to preserve my stamina. You're our latest recruit, right? It's Steve, isn't it? I couldn't be more grateful to you for rescuing me. As I mentioned before, I was the one who sent out that emergency signal. The rest of the, the, rest of the rescue corps, well, it was a rough landing. We entered the planet's atmosphere and lost control of the ship. What happened? I have no idea. 
There were six officers on the ship, but we were separated when we ejected from the spacecraft. Oh, no. Came here to find Captain Olimar, whose own ship had crashed, only to suffer the same fate. Almost embarrassing. I've confirmed that our spaceship, the SS Shepard, landed somewhere over there. But I couldn't reach it on my own. Now that you're here, maybe we can find a way back to it. And if we're lucky, we'll come across a few stranded rescue officers along the way. Oh, before I forget, take this. It's an official Rescue Corps tablet. We use them to share information. Thank goodness I always carry an extra. Tap uh, D-pad up on the left side there to open and review the missions. Steve! You met up with Gully. Uh, you can use this app anytime to confirm what tasks are top priority. I have some other handy apps to share, but I'll install them later when we have a moment to rest. For now, just remember that you can always tap D-pad up to view missions. But if you press minus to select shortcut settings, you can assign different functions to each shortcut button. Cool. Now then, let's find the SS Shepard. That's where I came from. There doesn't seem to be anything there. There's the ship! There she is! The yes, SS Shepard! I can see the ship, but I have no idea how we're gonna reach it from here. You know, there's something familiar about this area. I remember something! It's just up ahead, let's go! I didn't even see it at first. Planet! The plants on this planet are gigantic! Always make sure the area is safe with uh, the right stick. Look! That's it! See the big hole in the ground over there? Only we could find a way there. Then we could finally reunite with the SS Shepard. Alright. It's impossible to get over that ledge. There's something under the dirt. Add out to Ochi. This is a perfect job for a rescue pup. They're known for being excellent diggers. The sub that imploded. Good pup, Ochi. You're making easy work of all that dirt. Almost there. There we go. Hey, hey! You can see why rescue pups are the rescue corps' pride and joy. Huh? This looks like the other hole we saw. Well done, Ochi! I wonder if these two holes are somehow connected underground. Looks pretty deep. We're just gonna have to dive right in. For real? Rescue Corps officer must act with courage in the face of any danger. Though it does look pretty dark down there. Alright, let's do it. Burrow of Beginnings, sub-level 1. Information about exploration and related topics will be shown here. Put that knowledge to good use in your rescue work. Dunk. Okay. Hey, what is it, Ochi? He's trying to tell us something. Perhaps another rescue officer is down here. Well, we better go find them. No. Looks like a dead end. Try somewhere else. Those are enemies. Oh my god, are those baby bulb orbs? Oh my, what a place to find the captain! That terrified individual you see over there is the captain of our rescue team, uh, rescue corps team. Look sharp, Steve! The captain comes from a long line of rescue officers. This is no time for a history lesson! Hurry up and do something! Fuck him up! Oh no, she's surrounded by creatures! Fuck him up, Ochi. They're dead. Cap, you're okay. Phew, now we can relax a bit. Captain, we took care of the creatures down here. Can you get down? I hope so. My arms are almost numb. I've been hanging on so long. She's gonna fall and hit her head. I knew it. What's your status, Colin? Are you okay? Shouldn't I be asking you that? I'm just relieved to see you're alright. Oh, you! I haven't seen you since rookie training camp. I'm Captain Shepard of the Rescue Corps, if you don't remember. 
Did you order Ochi to get rid of those creatures all by yourself, Steve? Huh. She's not supposed to obey anyone. Just that rookie training paid off after all, didn't it? You know, if the first time I saw you in training, I had a feeling you'd make a top-notch dog trainer. Rescue Corps Captain Shepard. Home Planet Gia. A 99th Gen Rescue Corps Officer. She was saved by a rescue pup as a child, sparking a lifelong love for her furry colleagues. Found Captain Shepard. Three down, just a few more to go. We found Captain Shepard. With the captain here, it feels like there may be some hope for us after all. Oh, hey. Sorry to interrupt, Captain, but uh, what were you doing down here anyway? Monocle. While exploring the surface, I discovered a suspicious hole. I leaned over to take a look inside and fell right in. Wandered around this cave trying to find an exit when I came up on those icky, slimy creatures. Hang on! Did you fall down the hole located near the SS Shepherd? We entered this cave in an attempt to reach that very opening. Well then, what are we waiting around here for? Let's get back to the SS Shepherd. Copy that. Is this really what we're doing? Something wrong? You didn't say anything, Steve. Copy that is the Rescue Corps way of saying understood. Let's try saying it together, okay? Copy that. Copy that. Very good. Excellent reply. That said, you'll need to review the Rescue Corps Rescue Journal for the upcoming missions. It's central to our work. Rescue Journal installed. This is where you'll find advice left by captains both past and present. I have no doubt that the knowledge and wisdom they share here will guide you well. Irma Shepard, Captain in Command. You'll be able to access them via your tablet as the need arises. Put them to good use while out in the field. Since Oshi and you have bonded, I officially approve of your partnership. I'll be observing you both to see what skills you have as a rescue pup trainer. Okay. Quite the conundrum. What would you do, Steve? That was quite a rush! I'm curious, though. Uh... Tablet menu? There we go. Alright, radar map, which... Good. Missions, which is alright. ID badges. Oh! That's awesome. I like that a lot. Rescue journal. Rescue journal, checking your surroundings. Right stick. And then ZL to snap forward. And then rush. That's nice. Especially if you haven't played in a while. It's like a... A refresher tutorial. No. I remember this area. There's the exit. How do we get up there, though? Oh, right. There! That's where I fell in! Oh, no. My word, to think you survived a fall from that... Colin, so did we. Like, honestly? <laughs> but more importantly, how are we supposed to climb up there? Hey, there's something under the light. Yeah, I know. Oh, it's an air vent. Whoa! Hmm. Interesting. Very interesting. But, after this cutscene... Excuse me, Steve. Suggest you exercise a bit more caution when encountering something unfamiliar. Maybe don't just touch it. I completely agree, though in this case, your impulsive behavior did get us out of that cave. Alright, Captain. The Rescue Corps flag has been officially planted. Now for the status report on all cave-related activities. We located and rescued one castaway, and no other individuals were found during our search. Noted! Then let's consider the investigation of this cave complete. Hope this experience will help you prepare for the challenges inherent to our work. There are lives depending on us. But well, you both did good work today. Well done, Steve and Ochi. Yes, we're just gonna skip right over the fact that we had to rescue the captain herself. Colin, you look different since the last time I saw you. Do you do something new with your hair? I don't think so. I've been a bit busy trying to, you know, stay alive. Of course. Good for you. You did it. Well, here she is, the SS Shepherd. <laughs> yes, Patrick. 
that this calling character has a pretty big chance to leave an impact on players. But with that, the YouTube version is done. I'd like to thank you all for watching. And if you want to see more, come over to the VOD channel where I will continue from here. See you guys next time for another Vinny Visits.